side note, I'm making another video while well, currently editing it and decided to take a break because the video was done with two cameras and one camera decided to stop rolling um, during the footage and the sync up uh, 12 minutes into the video kind of sucks and um, I figured I'd take a break and clean up the video. In off mode, the um, well, it's off at the thermostat. There is a 0.41 amp, which is 410 milliamp load on the transformer. That's it doing nothing. Um, and um, that's 410 milliamps. And Ogini, um, brought out a tech last year and recommended a 70 VA transformer um, and only put a 50 VA in um, to do the math again real quick um, 50 divided by 24 equals uh, 2 amps so um, we're technically using 25% of the power out of the transformer just in idle um, what is a misnotion is when you use a transformer to drive analog circuits, uh, coils and other resistive components, um, it's a one to one ratio. When you're using it to drive um, these new thermostats that are digital that are inductive, i.e. capacitors and inductors, um, you're not going to be able to pull the, the, the full two amps out of it um, without causing an issue. It's just the way electronics work. So we're going to run over there real quick to thermostat, um, make sure it is off and everything, you know, to, to keep the, you know, video uniform and whatnot. Um, and uh, I'll talk as I go, but I'm going to cover this up. Um, Ogini says it's not their fault. The thermostat is short cycling. In the other video, I actually explain more about that, and I find a fault that they both they don't. So it's got a half amp um, draw, and it's in off mode. Um, let's just turn on the fan and see what we get. Again. I'm kind of making a second video, <clears throat> as you can tell my voice is out. I was already at um, the other one, but since it has a sinking problem, we uh, have to do two. Um, now we're at uh, another 110 milliamps on top of that. That is just in fan mode alone. Um, so if you were to figure um, adding the um, heat pumps, reversing valve that has to operate for cool mode, um, I don't, the um, cooling relays out there. Um, also, so you're looking at, you know, another um, couple hundred million. So you're up to one eight, um, approximately, give or take, just a little bit. Then if that thermostat decides it wants to use its maximum power that it can, it can suck down 400 milliamps, which is half an amp. So you're at 75% of the power, but remember at that point, you're using a non-resistive device, the thermostat, so you're not gonna get full power, i.e. it shuts itself down and um, short cycles. Also, in the other video, I find that uh, the fuse holder is a little crappy, which OGNE's first tech uh, put in last year, and it's a little shoddy, but that was causing a secondary um, short cycling. But um, the primary reason for the short cycling is, as you can see in just fan mode, we're sucking down half an amp. Um, the other video explains it all a um, lot more drawn out, a lot longer. Um, also, this is not in the heat mode, it, it's not on, it's just fan. Um, so you can tell that it's, it's going to exceed its power relatively easy and then make the thermostat short cycle, i.e. turn on and off, and uh, thus blow it up. The other video, um, I'm going to walk away from for a little bit because um, for the life of me, syncing it back up is not working out. After the 12 minute mark, I will upload it the way it is now, 
uh, gets a little confusing towards the end, but it still gets all the points. And then I'll upload this one um, for the shorter version. Sorry, I'm really tired. Um, kind of feel confused at the moment just because I got a whole bunch of other crap going on and um, I need to work on that, not this. Um, so this is like on a back burner, but yeah, it's been done in the front. And also my voice is going out. Um, so, uh, hope you understand and then um, you'll learn more as it goes on.